Hi everyone, I'm here to share with you a really great story. We've had a contribution of $1,000 to the Somewhere Saskatchewan campaign in honor of a truly remarkable man in our community, Howard Willems. Now, Howard passed away on November 8th, but right up until then, he was a fierce advocate, a really passionate volunteer, and a beloved mentor to many people here. For over a decade, Howard served on the board of the Core Neighborhood Youth Co-op, which is an organization that provides alternative education programs and skill building programs to youth. So really giving hope to people who might have lost it. And I think that is the greatest gift that anyone can give. I'm really honored by um, the opportunity to tell you about this man, to inspire you with his story, and to perform a song that I think Howard would have appreciated. Because I think Howard would agree that many of us today have enough money to believe in abundance. We have enough friends to believe in love. We have enough luck to believe that if we wish, it'll come. But not everybody has these things. So we learn it's better to give than to receive money or love, power or peace. You gotta give what you get and what you have will increase. Did you miss the chance to give a kiss and feel real bliss? Because your lips were wrapped tight around the lie that you held the only version of truth that night. Well, if so, just let your lips go. Wrap around a truth much sweeter. Because what do you risk by being a believer? the person who last made you feel beautiful or smart or sexy or simply so full of love that you had to give because you could not contain the ocean you were floating in. Picture the person who makes you believe that dreams can be as real as the concrete crumbling and worn on the street where you live. Picture that person, all they have to give. Picture the person who disarmed you with a compliment, touched your heart when you were most convinced that dreams are dimes and maybe years are spent. Picture the person collecting the rent, the person who gave you back those dimes and convinced you that there's still time to wander down to the wishing well, flip dimes into the water, converting dreams. Picture that person, the things that they wear. Picture that funny little wave in their hair. Picture the last place you felt alive. Now, who was with you that night? Maybe it's someone who was simply kind, who had the time to give you a smile. Picture the person who makes you feel what it feels like to be divine. Picture that person in shades of blue. Picture that person in their own truth. Picture that person and the things that they do and ask who is picturing you.